Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog here on the channel. It is Mike, also known as Super Cali in game, and I want to tell you guys all about Wagger Soccer Con Boston. So, as you guys know from me talking about it in pretty much every video for the past month before, I went to Walker Soccer Con in Boston on, on August 23rd and 24th, I believe the dates were, and I had an amazing time. Oh my god, it was so cool. I got to see so many celebrities, so many cast members, so many things. I, I was in the panels, I was just all over the place. It was it was so cool being there, it's just seeing all the stars and seeing all the fans and the cosplayers and there was so much mer merchandise and just everything. Like, I don't even know how to put it into words how amazing this was. So I thought I would show you instead. I did gather quite a few clips of my panel time that I was pretty upfront and close. The footage isn't great, but it's not terrible. I was in the second row third row for like all the panels because I was a gold member. I will tell you guys more about that after I show you guys all these clips. I tried to vlog the whole thing but it didn't really work out that way because as you know it's a crazy thing at convention. You want to like capture and take pictures and do everything but like I'm holding so much stuff for half the convention that I really didn't even get the chance to take pictures and film everything I wanted to, but I did film like all the panel stuff and that's I think the most important and I will show you guys all the stuff that I bought at the end of the video after you see the clips. So sit back, relax, and enjoy some of these very interesting panels that I went to in the convention. Hey guys, it's the first day of Walker Soccer Con and all I can think about right now is whether or not I should be wearing this hat and why my lighting is so bad, but hi. Okay, so it's day one. I'm waiting for my mom right now. I don't know where she is. Fashionably late as always. My grams is driving us in to Boston and we don't know what we're gonna do after that. We're just gonna play it by ear. It's gonna be a fun day. I can't wait. Wait till you see it. I'm so excited. I get to go in an hour early and everything. Ah, gold admission. I love it. Okay, um, I'm really excited. Really nervous for some reason. But I will see you guys soon. We're here at the convention. There's mom. Say hi, Mom. Okay. Really? And there's the center. There's the Weston. The convention is right around the corner. I'm so excited. I my hear Clem's voice coming from Melissa. I mean, I can't, nobody's at the mic, so I can't ask. But I, that first time, it's always so interesting. You're so used to seeing it come from somebody else. Do you get what kind of reactions do you get when you do the voice? And there's just like a few Oh, all things. kinds. I should be, I, I mean, I really should be filming all the reactions because some people just like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, you know, freak out. Because I mean, my, my natural speaking voice is obviously, it's a lot deeper. Um, but um, yeah, all kinds of reactions. Some of the best reactions are people just like, I had no idea an adult was doing the voice, you know, and that's, that's a really awesome compliment just because, uh, you know, it was important that this kid be real, real genuine. It's hard, but says two words, and now my life has changed. I was an affable guy, an actor from Ohio that's been rearranged. See, on The Walking Dead, I sat on a porch and was a bit of a jerk to Rick. Now, because of that scene, at least on Twitter, I'm apparently porch dick. Porch dick? I don't even know what that means. Porch dick. How do I explain that to my mom? It sounds like a sag old for a low budget porno flip. And there are lots of other things about me, if you really want to know the truth. My wife's a funny actor, I've worked on Broadway, I've got beehives on a roof. But none of those things matter now, it's enough to make you sick. Because of that scene, at least on Twitter, I'm a parent. <laughs> 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 or, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> WSC Boston. We also have a new uh, Instagram site. It's a Walker Stalker, both without ease, con. Walker Stalker con, no ease. Uh, did any of y'all dub smash? No. Walker Stalker con, Boston. How you doing today? Woo! 
Now, now, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm from Boston, Mass. So I know the Boston fans can do better than that. Walker, Stalker Con Boston, how are you doing today? <laughs> we need the energy up because these individuals uh, have high energy and are fantastic. Uh, so without further ado, this is the Originals panel. We have some amazing folks waiting to come up here, the Originals. Ladies and gentlemen, you know them as T-Dog and Jackie. It's Irony e. Singleton, it's Gerald Prescott. Come on up! <laughs> Feel free to come up to the mics anytime and we'll do Q&A interspersed with me talking to these guys. So welcome back to the stage. This is, you've done a few Walker Stalker cons now. How is it to be at a convention that's mostly about another show? What's it like for you guys? You know, it's a lot. It feels like, in a way, it's um, very, you know, with great gratitude I'm here because I feel like the fans for Walker Stalker, um, who, which is also, you know, obviously, uh, uh, is a AMC show. Um, to be invited here, the, the fans are so great. Uh, our show is a very different show, but kind of shares the same audience. And so it's uh, it's exciting to see so many of you guys here. Um. <sighs> Wasn't that cool? I know. It's so weird seeing them all up close and personal and 
how they are in real life, and oh my god, like, the Nene one, though, is probably my favorite. Seeing Irony do the Nene with, like, the fans, and it was so cute. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm going to get right into uh, the things that I got on the convention. First off was this shirt. Walker Soccer Con. Can you see it all? Am I? Okay. So I got this uh, for being a gold member. I also got this badge, like I showed you before. So basically what this badge did, it granted me like access to basically everything. Being a gold member meant I got to go to like the front of the line for everything, which was awesome because there's some really long lines, especially when you're you want to get an autograph or you want to do a photo op, or especially for the panels. Like this is probably worth it just to be able to get in front of all the panels and get in the beginning of the lines and just if you're like really impatient and don't want to wait for like 100 people. It's pretty nice, especially for the panels, because, like, no matter what, you're going to be sitting in the front. Oh, so it's pretty cool, as you could, as you saw in the vlog, like, I... Okay, so moving on to some of the other things I got besides that, I also got... Do you know what this is? This is the Clementine hat. I would have worn it for this vlog, but I have to wear this to talk. Yeah, this is the Clementine hat. I got this little beauty at one of the vendors. There were so many vendors to buy so many things that it was ridiculous. So I got that. As you guys saw in one of the panels that I went to, Melissa Hutchison, the voice of Clementine from The Walking Dead game, as you guys know, I'm playing it on the, my channel currently. She was there, and I did go to her booth the day after the panel, and I got this. Look at it. Nice, let me get you up close and personal here. If you guys can't read what it says, it says, Mike. It was great meeting you at Walker Soccer Con Boston. Thanks for protecting Clem. Still not bitten. M, M Hutch Heart Clem. <sighs> Talk about a geek out moment meeting the voice of Clem. She even did the voice for me. Like, she started talking to me in the voice. Okay, this is <laughs> this is what I realized in this convention. I'm not good at talking to celebrities. Like, I'm not one of those people that freak out and, like, scream and, like, do things I'm not supposed to do. I'm that fan that basically can't talk around people. And, like, you meet a celebrity and you're just, like, choking up. Speaking of choking up, the next thing I'm going to show you guys are my photo ops. So, because I was a gold member, I got two free photo op vouchers. So basically, I could take a picture with Celebrity for free. The first one I got was this. Is that is stupid glare? It was me and Melissa Ponzio. Stop glare. Uh, better. Okay, so this is me, Melissa Ponzio. It was so cool meeting her. She is so nice. Like, God, I couldn't even. That was the first one I think I took my picture with. And then here we have me and Emily Kinney, who played Beth. She's my favorite, by far. I had to get a photo with her. I just had to. Sorry about the glare, but, like, this is... Look at that. She's so nice. I was so nervous, and I look so bad in these photos, but whatever. Memories. So the next thing I got was just an autograph. I had two free autographs. The first one was Melissa, and the second one was... Christian Santos. Serratos? Santos. I forget. Uh, she plays Rosita, obviously. I went to her booth, like, really fast, and I got this autograph. She, I just picked one out, she signed it, and I was like, hi and bye, and I left. Like, I was so nervous. I uh, don't even, I don't even know. I don't even know. Okay, so the next thing I got, I didn't actually get it, my mom got it for me. She surprised me at the very end of the convention with this. It is... The Walking Dead, The Poster Collection, Volume 2, 40 removable posters. Yeah, I had to read it while I, I spoke. There are, there's so many things, like, I can't even, like, look at this. Look at it! I'm gonna have these plastered all over my wall in no time. I might actually wait till I move rooms and go down cellar, oop, upside down, before I, like, put them everywhere, because, like, I, I don't want to waste them right now, because I really don't have that much room, and I really want to put like all these things on my wall first and then I'll worry about posters but yeah so that was really nice of her so the literal last thing I got at the convention right before I left was this book Omega Days by John L. Campbell the author himself John L. Campbell was there selling them and talking about his book and signing them so I was like 
I gotta get this. I'm terrible at reading books, but I really do want to read it. So I got it, and he signed it. And let me find what he said. He said, for Mike, zombie fans are the best sort of people. And then he has his name signed there. How cool, how cool is that? That he's just selling his book and signing them for people. I mean, I guess it's good advertising on his part. Apparently this is like a 7, 8 book series, but only four, 4 or 3 of them are out right now. But apparently, once you start, you can't stop. So I guess I'm in trouble, because I'm going to get addicted. Okay guys, so that is it for this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed me talking about it. I didn't really do a lot of talking, but I wanted to show you, I mostly just wanted to show off what I got and show off my footage from the panel. So I hope it was cool to see. I know it was so cool being there and I can't wait for next year. I didn't miss a lot of stuff. I stayed the whole first day, but not the whole second day, and I missed a lot of after convention stuff that was happening because I wasn't staying at the hotel, but there's always next year. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I, I don't do vlogs very often, but for this kind of thing, I just had to talk about it and show it off because, you know, I'm the biggest Walking Dead fan, and if it's something Walking Dead related, I'll probably talk about it and vlog about it, and this was just the perfect opportunity to do it, even though this is a gaming channel. I still like to do my vlogs. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this. Until next time, I guys, I will see you guys in game very soon. And if you haven't, go check out my Walking Dead game series because episode 4 is coming, okay? Be kind of another. Bye guys.